Hello, in this video I'm going to talk about the addition radical mechanism step. Uh, the addition step occurs when a radical adds to a pi bond. Let me show you a generic version about what that might look like. So let's um, let's have, a, oh, we'll do ux so we can be fairly generic. And let's have uh, an alkene. Uh, we use ethene as a generic example. Here's a radical. Draw the reaction arrow. Uh, now I need some radical arrows again. But, but before I do the radical arrows, I'm going to show you what that looks like. So we're, well, no, let me draw. Let me draw these arrows. So. What's going to happen is the this radical is going to bump into the alkene, and it's going to add to the alkenes. We're going to form a new carbon-halogen bond here, and we're going to do it at the expense of the pi bond. So the pi bond is going to break. Uh, and here's how I like to represent it, but there's no reason you can't represent it, again, on the same side of the uh, alkene. So we're going to generate this new carbon halogen bond and we're going to do it at the expense of the pi bond and we're going to end up with a radical over here on the the carbon uh, on the other side of the alkene so let's um all right let's do a, a this is this is pretty much how it goes let's do a more specific example from the bromination or the anti-Markovnikov sort of radical bromination of an alkene. So you can do it even use propene as my alkene here. It's gonna happen. Bromine radical is gonna interact with the pi bond. One electron of the pi bond is going to be used to make the new carbon bromine bond. Other electron in the pi bond is going to be used to make the radical on the other carbon. And that's going to look like this. And if we count up our radicals, we have one radical on the left and we have one radical on the right. So again, there's no, in this, in the addition step, there's no net change of the number of radicals, which makes this a common propagation step. The very last, uh, the, or sorry, the next video in the series is going to be about uh, the elimination radical mechanism step, which is the last of the six common radical mechanism steps. Um, and I saved it to go after addition because it is essentially the addition mechanism step in reverse. Thanks for watching.